Good morning. I'm be reading out of my devotional this morning, Jesus Calling by Sarah Young, April 14th. Happy birthday to my daughter, Gary. Heaven is both present and future. As you walk along your life path holding my hand, you're already in touch with the essence of heaven, nearness to me. You can also find many hints of heaven along your pathway because the earth is radiantly alive with my presence. Shimmering sunshine awakens your heart, gently reminding you of my brilliant light. Birds and flowers, trees and skies evoke praises to my holy name. Keep your eyes and ears fully open as you journey with me. At the end of your life pass and then is entrance into heaven. Only I know when you will reach that destination, but I am preparing you for it each step of the way. The absolute certainty of your heavenly home gives you peace and joy to help you along your journey. You know that you will reach your home in my perfect timing, not one moment too soon or too late. Let the hope of heaven encourage you as you walk along the path of life with me. We have this hope as an anchor for the soul, firm and secure. It enters the inner sanctuary behind the curtain. But Christ has indeed been raised from the dead, the first fruits of those who have fallen asleep. For since death came through a man, the resurrection of the dead comes also through a man. For as in Adam all die, so in Christ all will be made alive. But each is his own turn, Christ the first fruit. Then when he comes, those who belong to him, 1 Corinthians 15, 20, 13. And there's a lot. There's a lot to cover here in this devotional. And uh, I, I think that... Uh, we're all going to leave earth we're all going to leave this earth and um i spent a lot of time thinking about that a long time ago and now i'm secure in knowing that when i do die i am going to go to my heavenly home and and uh, I, can, I can't imagine what heaven's going to look like if he created the world in seven days and all its magnificent wonder can you imagine what he's doing now he's preparing a place for you is what the word says he's been preparing a place for you for over two thousand years i can't even probably put into words of how magnificent heaven's going to be and who wouldn't want to go to heaven and it's important to know that we have to make peace with god before we leave earth because if we don't we're going to be separated and lost it mentions adam and we had the perfect relationship and the the beginning with God but then Adam and Eve did what they did in the garden and we were basically kicked out of paradise and we wound up down here with the enemy of our soul and, and he has us now here on earth and we're stuck here until we die and then once we die we get to go either there or here or heaven or hell it's where we get to go but we have to be sure God has made a guarantee and that guarantee is Jesus Christ so make peace with God receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and you'll be guaranteed a place in that heavenly home be encouraged today and know God loves you